All right, activating the extra story is a bit weird since I have to do it through this option here. Okay, let's grab my clear data. Since it's on Calamity, extra story will also be on Calamity. Or the after story, yeah. It's October now. It's been months and they probably haven't even gained a single level. Hey, they're using the Halloween costume for Spica. If I beat this chapter, maybe they'll add it to the character viewer. Uh, looks like... <laughs> Uh, looks like the star camera lady also has Halloween costumes. I forgot to buy a lottery ticket! Oh well, it's not like it gives that much money even if you win. Jugatsumatsu Wonder if we'll get a Halloween themed dungeon where there's evil pumpkin greeds attacking us. Oh, we're going to Morimiya Academy Second Semester. Well, at least it won't be as hot. Hopefully. Wait, then again, the weather in Japan might work differently since it's in a different part of the world from the US, so... I don't know if it's actually hotter or colder. Since everyone's in long sleeves, it'll probably be colder. <laughs> since when are you voiced Mr. Tanabe? Maybe he g gained his voice after dating uh, the uh, Miss Keiko. <laughs> Became sig a significant enough character to warrant a voice. Hi. <laughs> そこにあったのはいつの古い手紙 方を伝う熱いものを拭うことすらはすれ。私はただかつての故郷を思うのでした。そこまで。素晴らしい。うん、主人公の切ない心情がありありと伝わってくるようだ。先生、この小説大好きでな。ああ、いかいか。目頭が
、なんでもねなんていうか、平和だなぁと思ってな。<笑>変なこうちゃん。あれから3ヶ月かあの慌ただしい日々がずっと昔のことみたいね。But the fact that we're getting an after story means that something's not quite right. Some unresolved issue is out there. Could also be a way to lead into the sequel. Say we fail to kill some enemy here, and it shows up in the sequel as the main villain. Got it. Kendo practice. All right, class is finally over. Let's get going. Where are you carrying? Are you going to, to your club today? That's surprising. Now, it's just something I forgot to take home with me. I stepped in my locker and then forgot about it, but the club's he head told me to take it home. Also, I've been waiting for today for so long, so what makes you think I'd waste time by going to my club? Oh man, that's not something you should be proud of, you know? I have to admit being I have to admit to being excited as well. I went for the first time last year, so I'm definitely looking forward to the festival this year too. I wonder what kind of events they have planned for this year. Let's see, all the performances are scheduled for the evening, and every year they're different. Also, the rumor going around is that the grand finale is going to be held at Sunshine Road. Isn't Sunshine, uh, Sunshine Road that shopping promenade that runs alongside the monorail tracks? Sounds like a new location. That's where we were planning on meeting today. Yeah, that hasn't changed. I heard that Spica is going to be performing, so needless to say, I'm pretty stoked. Oh crap, there's going to be a buttload of people there. <laughs> oh, Hiragi! Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I'm glad Hiragi and the rest of the gang are coming too. It is difficult to find time that works with everyone's schedules. That's why group projects are so difficult, especially in college where everyone has a totally different schedule. Well, I guess we all got lucky this time. I'll head on over as soon as I'm done with work. Jeez, Ko. Dude, did you really need to set up a gig for today? It's to make up for not winning, uh, for not getting the lottery last time, I guess. Well, I normally wouldn't have, but Yukino set it up for me a long time ago. The night of day before. Hey you, good work today. So you're free tomorrow, right? More or less. Just remember I'll be meeting up with everybody at night, so keep that in mind. Well, if that's how it has to be, it's fine, I guess. At least I hope it'll be time enough. I have a few autumn festival related jobs for you. Doesn't it seem like your popularity has gone up, up quite a bit of, as of late? Uh, it's kind of nice, not not going to lie. Anyway, I'll send you all the details via Niar tomorrow around when you get out of class. Good luck with it all. Are these really difficult jobs? Maybe Eclipse related? That smile made me more than a little nervous. I have it all planned out. I'll be able to make it with plenty of time to spare, so don't worry. You weren't, You haven't changed at all. Jeez, you better be there. We haven't been able to get to Gara since the fireworks festival. Tonight we're going to have so much fun and... Huh? 
いつまでおしゃべりしてるつもりあんたと小日向君は夜まで商店街を手伝う約束でしょああそっか僕も亮太に頼まれてたっけほらさっさと行くわよま,ま待ってってもうちょい柊さんとおしゃべりをおだまり言っとくけど終わるまで遊びになんか行かせないからねそそんな殺生な<笑>それは頑張らないとねじゃあみんなまた夜に。ちゃんも大変だね<笑>クラス委員会の帰りとかにたまに愚痴を聞いたりするけどわざわざ手伝いに行くあたり純も物好きっつうか Could there be something eclipse related there? Hmm Where he's doing his own investigation? さて私たちも用事があるからそろそろ失礼させてもらうわそうだね急がないとまた後でね紅ちゃん遅刻しちゃダメだよ分かった分かったそんじゃあな2人ともそういや聞きそびれたが用事って一体何なんだクラス委員の用事ってわけでもなさそうだがまあいい俺もそろそろ行くか雪乃さんからの連絡はまだ来てねえみたいだな。はっ、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、わし、Obtain summer clothes for the XRC members. Huh. A chained voicemail. Any, any new friend entries? Shiori has one, obviously. Now she's alive. Wait, what? There's no fifth entry. It just says it's just her fourth entry, but now her, page is her image is restored. Did we get any information on that fox from before? No. Also, shop info. Looks like we might get some new recipes too. New armor. But how will it compare to the golden element armor? Sylvia bracelet. Veggie noodle soup. Do you hear the news? Speaker is going to be doing an event at Sunshine Road. We better go stake out a good spot before it's too late. Yeah, definitely. Hold up, Yuji. Don't you have club activities today? I'm sure they'll be fine without me. It's just going to be a bunch of running today, right? I don't care if you're sick of running or not. You realize in order to build stamina, you need to. Didn't they have this exact argument six months ago? Yuji, getting good grades doesn't mean you can, you can then slack off, you know? Yeah, I was interested in seeing Speaker's performance, but. Oh, but Reika's new um, uniform can be seen in person. No, I can't get distracted. So, time to skip track and go secure a good spot for the performance. That reminds me, during lunch, I, I spotted the back of a cute girl. 
They look kind of familiar, but I'm kind of curious. Summer costume. Normal. Festival costume. The same one that... <laughs> same one that they were using for Spica's commercial. Wait a minute. Why doesn't Rion have one? She was wearing one in the commercial, yet Asuka and Sora are the ones who have the festival costume. What? That doesn't seem right. Yeah, today's the autumn festival. I've been waiting for this. It's so calm and quiet. What great oxygen. Wait, what? Great oxygen? Oh, you know, that thing, um... A feeling in the air? You mean atmosphere. Hmm. I'm also going to have an event. Ugh, my stomach has been hurting me ever since the second semester began. Not only is there an autumn festival, but exams and school activities are still coming up. No, I mustn't be like this. I need to show how I was reborn after that earthquake. A large number of activities are planned from now until the end of the school year, but... I can't let my stomach pains beat me. I must do my best as a teacher. On for third years. Time for them to look solidly towards their future. I need to buckle down and say so I can become a police officer. I wonder what Shio's going to do. He doesn't talk much about himself. Hmm, playing the career paths. Must be tough for the third years. That didn't get me a, a friend page? I, I thought something as relevant as that would show up. Like, I want to be a cop in, in his final page. The city's yearly event. I'm not against enjoying the Alvin Festival itself, per se. But festivals tend to stir up trouble. The seniors have only just finished their exam, so they should be extra careful. I'm off to the library again today to get some studying in for exams. Feel free to enjoy the autumn festival, but make sure you stay out of trouble. Hmm, there's no affinity shards. I guess no way to, there's no way I'm going to be able to max out anyone's soul points this time. I'm studying so that I may succeed my father as head of the Takamatsu group. I've accompanied him on his site visit, so I am more knowledgeable than any other commoner, a contender. But college exams are depressing. I wonder if Mitsuki could help me with them at all. Sounds like they get along pretty well. Back then, she probably wouldn't ha have been willing to ask for help. I have no doubt Mitsuki is going to be chosen as a successor of the Hokuto group. There is no way I'm losing to her. I must try harder. The first exams. Ugh, so depressing. The worst part about exams is that even if you pass them, you you, you wonder if, if 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 that really means you're smart. After all, all you did was pass something for them at the moment. You don't know if you'll retain that knowledge forever, or if you'll be able to use it in any way. Trusted rival. Rough. Hurrah, hurrah! Mori, mi, ya! It's great to be on the cheer team. I was able to go cheer for a lot of clubs over the summer, and it was a lot of fun. I want to keep doing my best, yeah. Oh yeah, the sports festival is this autumn. I'm so excited. There will be a lot of chances for the cheer team to help out. Hmm. Wait a minute. Uh, the door to the club room is unlocked? Th that voice! Uh, there might be a secret quest here. Hmm. Enter anyways. Hey, who's in there? Rion and Rion, you do have that. Co you do have the autumn festival costume. Then, what's up, 
びっくりして損しちゃった。You have that costume, you should have it available in the equipment screen too, shouldn't you? Or is that going to be her current default costume? But I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do it. Oh, yeah, did, she, did, did Haruna tell Rian about the Mori Maru incident? Oh, what's up? But what I meant was, what are you doing here? <laughs> Oh, yeah, next up, one incident. I, I think their attempt to surprise Rion at school probably didn't really work since Rion already knew they were in the city at that point. Plus, the manager kind of spilled, all, uh, spilled the beans. Oh, if that's what's going on, then it's all good. But we are friends, you know. You could have at least just asked or at least said something. Oh, yeah. Speaking of surprises, are those new costumes? They have a definite autumnish vibe. <laughs> yeah, it looks good. Pretty nice. It doesn't matter what you. Wait, you actually said that? About yourself? <laughs> Although none of what we've been doing could be even remotely considered club activities. Anyway, use the club room as, for as long as you need to, and good luck tonight. <laughs> Hi. Friend page updated. Chilling the XRC club room with Haruna with their new costumes. That's and now she is ma now her pages are maxed out, but not her soul points. I think. All right, let's do a quick rundown on the set one last time. Be careful when you go outside so you don't set up a riot or anything. Um, I think it's too late to worry about that. Reika and the heirs took our manager with them to go look for a place to practice. Um, don't worry about it. And if things get out of hand, that just means more exposure for us. Damn, all of you have nerves of steel. So this is the vaunted club room. We'll be borrowing it for just a little while longer. We have to have everything absolutely perfect for everyone for tonight's performance. We need to get ready for our performance. I have the feeling our next single will be influenced by what kind of reception we get tonight. Yeah, our manager didn't come out and say it, but... I wouldn't be surprised if the same thing happened after the summer tour happened again. I'm not going to be the one dropping the ball. Neither will I. With that said, I'm not going to be able to make the band meeting today. But don't worry, my performance will, be, will more than make up for it. The piece I submitted to the Summer Novel Contest was given an honorable mention. It's only a high school level contest, but it gave me a little bit of self-confidence boost. I want to keep writing novels, little by little. I was asked to read to the children's club in my neighborhood tonight. I might be able to borrow some of the experience from my writing. The Autumn Festival season has arrived. A long autumn um, night, a sky lit with festive fun, Morimiya's joy. It's wonderful to read with all the lights from the sea illuminating everything. Yeah, the, the people translating this would probably have to figure out an English translation that still works in a haiku. That must be tough. Reading an om is nice, but if only I could go to the festival with Mr. Goro. Oh my, what am I saying? What? No shot. I made some snacks in celebration of the Um Festival and Halloween. Here, please try some. 
Homemade punk pumpkin pie. Oh, thank you very much. The almond water makes you hungry, doesn't it? I can't seem to stop myself. Uh, if only I could be as carefree at eating like Nobuo always is. Yeah, I need to get some new recipes and see if I can make it for him. Speaking of, he's really late. I wonder if he got distracted eating well on his errand. Hmm. Some kind of event the moment I leave the school building. Autumn is the perfect season for sports. The track team is working hard building strength for the road relay race in the winter. We need to do our best so we get good results. Today I'm planning to wander the um, festival with my family. Until then, I better do my best in club. Oh, she, has a, she does have a band now. <laughs> but boy, what does the boy want from me? Ugh, this sucks. My dream of wandering the fe um, festival with my darling has been crushed. Ugh, who made plans with her without even thinking of me, the newest count student council member? Once I find them, they're gonna pay. If it's a man, I'll turn them to pieces. I better make myself scarce around school for a while. I made it into the student council, and we're spending glorious days together just like I dreamed. Well, my darling Mitsuki, who did you make plans with? I'm gonna have to charge in without an appointment. Love must find a way. Council of One. After showing her dedication and hard work, she finally got into the student council. Her victory was tempered by the fact that she couldn't go to the festival with Mitsuki. The day of the Om festival has arrived. <laughs> Mr. Tanabe actually asked about my plans in a roundabout way, but he didn't come out and invite me, so I thought, so maybe I'll drink by myself tonight. Walking in a crowd doesn't sound appealing. We'll drink at the bar alone instead. I wonder if Ko has a job at the bar this time. That would be awkward. Mai, don't you have club activities today? Not anymore. I'm bowing out of the club, so I don't think it'd be a good idea for me to meld too much. With Chiaki and Sora working together, I felt good enough to leave the club in their hands. With those two in charge, they should be able to win the national championships next year. Is that so? I'm glad you have such dependable club members to pass the torch to. But won't you get a little lonely? Uh, maybe a little. I've been feeling quite well lately. I need to make sure I have a lot of fun at the Autumn Festival of Mai today. Looks like I'm going to be recommended to a college. What a relief. It'd be great if Chiaki and Sora win nationals next year. No, the two of them will go even further. Voicemail! The new ARM menu I created earlier has been pretty popular. If you're going to check out the autumn festival, be sure you to eat up before you go. I thought so. There's a bunch of kids going to the festival. Make sure you eat your fill while you can. Wait, is it in the vending machine too? Yes, it is. How do you fit all that in there? This is a surprise. What a scoop. I better jump on getting a, an interview right away. I can't believe I just stumbled upon the most amazing scoop. Uh, what, what kind of scoop? No one's in the pool this time. Oh, that's the scoop. Training in the dojo. That voice it doesn't sound like anyone from the karate club. Should I take a peek? Enter the dojo. Even though. Oh. <laughs> hey, that's. Are you practicing karate? Probably practicing their their dance moves or something. Oh, I heard you guys were in the area, but I didn't expect you to be here. Yeah, Rion gave me a ticket to the Tokyo show. 
But anyway, you guys are doing great. You've all gotten way better since the first time I saw you. It's pretty incredible. Eh, <laughs> おしゃべりはまた後でね。さあ、若葉も明もうん。先輩たちには負けてられないね。Geez, I hope they're not forgetting that this is a school. I also have the same drive as athletes. Keep doing your best, Wakaba and Akira. Sora and the others are totally letting their practice slide right now. I probably shouldn't disturb them right now. I'll just leave, I guess. Speaka really does have an, uh, 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 have an aura about them, don't they? Yeah, yep. What do they eat that makes them so damn cute like that? Wait, no, I need to concentrate on the here and now. Right, we're going to win the national tournament next year for sure. Let's do our best, great leader Chiaki. We made it to the quarterfinals of the nationals during the summer tournament, but there's always someone better. I have to train even more. Ko, you'll train with me again sometime, right? Ah, uh, sure. Sadly, there's no greeds that bite like humans, so it's kind of hard to apply that to real life uh, to real life karate too Maya is retiring uh, retiring today starting next month I'm going to be team captain losing a third year will be rough but we'll definitely win at nationals Sora and I are gonna bring our best oh sure seriously even though school is over and there's going to be a riot if anyone finds out speakers here Please keep this to yourself, okay? Ha, <laughs> got it. Come on, Wakaba and Akira. We don't have much time until the show starts. If there's anything you think we need to work on, now's the time to do it. Of course. Got it. And it's in this it's in this shape, but I'm glad I was able to come to Rion and Tokisaka school. The situation is kind of weird. I'm glad I was able to see where you and Rion go to school. Boo, Reika takes the Spartan thing way too far sometimes. She's always looking out for us. The only way I can think to repay her is to nail our performance. Now you've made it through the summer tour, you're no longer juniors or anything like that. Now it's all on you where you go beyond the rest of us or not. Of course. Got it. Okay. Now we should have some more entries. Courage of Spica. She's professional enough to realize even a more well-rehearsed show will have hiccups and that's those unexpected moments that people remember. Friends equals rivals. After the last tour, she came to see Wakaba and Akira as equals and true members of the group. Of course, that means she's even harder on them now. But I have not finished Wakaba and Akira's entries for some reason. Hmm. I just realized I didn't run to Yuki at all, did I? Th was he in the computer room? だったら私と一緒におまつり見て回ろうよ。ああ、ずるい。私も私も。ははは。悪いがこれからちょっと用事があるんだ。ま、夜回りには行くから。どこかで会うこともあるかもな。指導されたくなかったらあまりハメを外さないように。えー、ていうか、むしろ指導されたい。早く終わんないかな。Still popular as always.
Mr. Goro. Ah, Tokitaka. Ima Kairika. Kyo mo arbaitoka. Omae mo nakanaka isongashina. Actually, my plan is to just chill out a little today. Mr. Goro, I didn't expect you to still be around. Word was that you were going back to the army full time after summer break. <laughs> I see. Thanks, Mr. Goro. これも当然の務めだろ。あれから3ヶ月早いものだ。新たな異界化もあれ以来起きていない。I see, I'm going to miss everyone. We're not going to have many opportunities to get together as the XRC in the future. And Shio and Mitsuki graduate next year too. ま、縁なんてものは <laughs> I still have a lot to learn. Relationships can't be broken so easily, huh? From Yukino. It looks like she finally got the details for, for, for my part time gig today. I put, posted a request for you on Niar. Go read it right now. It doesn't have to be perfect, it just has to be done. You shouldn't push your mental or physical capabilities, so do as much of it as you can. What the hell? She went through the hassle of posting on Niar. I've got a bad feeling about this. But usually Niar jobs pay better than these, uh, than these jobs that Yukino gives me, so hopefully... I'll make some decent, uh, 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 I'll make some decent money from this. Please check to see all of the quests that have been added. Season of Selling, Asuza. Great Pumpkin. S. What the? So all the ellipses. Thinking of hosting a pumpkin carving class. Yanagi. Brew. I sing the Brew Fest Electric. Hamaguchi. Hmm. Nice boat. That sounds like a Yandere situation. Dance for me, Morimaru. Don't tell me I've got to replace Morimaru again. But, oh, look at the payout on this. That's like... That's like over 10,000... Yen per job. Amazing. I might be even be able to afford new s stuff with this. Five of them? What the hell? Does she expect me to finish all of them today? I was set up. I never expected her to dump this much on me at once. I guess I'm pretty much committed. I better, I better see what I'm going to be up against. And I somehow have to finish all this in time to meet up with everybody. Is there a time limit, for real? After completing three or more quests and reporting them to Yukino at the antique store, the story will progress. Depending on the quest completed, more options for the penultimate event will become available. So try to burn through as many of Yukino's requests as you can. Of course I'm going to complete them all. I'm dirt poor and I didn't do the lottery. This is my only source of income. I guess that, that is it for the, the computer for the school. 
Now I can go anywhere. Mitsuki is in Station Square, huh? All oh, right, I had a quest here. Right. Our entry into the regional lunchbox competition this summer was a huge success. In fact, the Morimiya lunchbox is fast becoming a must-try for those visiting the city. As the event organizer, there's nothing more that I could ask for. Hey Grandpa, where are the pumpkins smiling? That's because they're looking forward to the festival today. Huh, and the, they're the same as me. A ticket bought from this very last stand was a big winner in the last Jumbo Lottery draw. Ah, oh, shoot! I should have bought it! <laughs> Since then, the weekly drawing tickets have been selling well. So well that we were sold out. And I'm, je I'm jealous of the winner. I hope that many more people can obtain happiness through the Jumbo Lottery at the end of the year. Ah! Oh! Curses! I've lost my last chance to get the $10,000. Cause it sounds like that was a guaranteed win. Maybe the fox was going to give me a guaranteed win as a bonus reward. At, after that final boss battle, huh? There, there sure are a lot of people around for this time of year. I get asked for directions by out-of-towners all the time. Huh. Things are getting kind of hectic. For all the people that travel to Morimiya for the autumn festival, I ho hope they really enjoy themselves. Sunshine Road will be right in front of you as you go under the monorail tracks. Just about everyone I've handed tissues to has asked me for directions. Jeez, at this point, I might as well have applied for a part-time job for the summer autumn festival. Another part-time job. I'm wait. I'm getting way too comfortable with job hopping. Hey Tokisaka, you're working here again today? You really helped me out when you took inventory last time. Uh, same to you, you've helped me out a lot as well. If you need my help again, just let Yukino know and she'll pass on your message. Well, you've proven to be reliable, so I'll def I definitely will do so. And don't forget our energy drinks if you ever get tired. The city has been so peaceful recently, and all thanks to you all. I've lost a lot of body fat since I started going to the gym, but recently I've been gaining weight. I wonder if I've been building too much muscle. Can't believe I gained weight through, from building too much muscle. I guess there's more, more to weight loss than mindless exercising. Well, on the bright side, you'll be that much more prepared if the greed start attacking the streets again. I've been trying to shop more efficiently by using my Xiphone to find stores with good prices. As an added bonus, I can look around the on festival, so it's a win-win for me. With all the stores having such big sales because of the festival, I've been able to save a fortune. Alright, it's time to head over to the supermarket next to the south entrance. There are so many sales going on during the autumn festival. I've heard that electronic stores are particularly aggressive with sales in the fall. Looking can be as fun as buying, though. The Spica album with their newest single, Midnight Fairy Tale, is finally on sale. I only started listening to them six months ago or so. I'm pretty much a total fanboy who pre-orders every single one of their releases. I just want to put on my headphones, chill out, and groups their amazing harmonies. I barely missed out on the perfect score in my last test. But luckily, my dad still bought me the RPG I wanted because he wanted to play it too. Oh well, man, did my mom go ballistic when she found out. I wish I could have escaped into a VR world or something. Parents sound strict. I'm not allowed to play any video games until I get a perfect score on my test. Reality blows. The high school girl talking to Akane. I think I saw her at a business seminar before. Oh, that's right. She's the Hokuto girl who, that's been helping run the family business. She's so young. And I'm not quite sure how Akane manages to connect with so many people, but I'm not surprised. I consider it an honor to be able to work beside her. Uh, Miss Mitsuki and Kiyoka, on an inspection tour? Oh, it's nothing like that. We're just walking around the festival together. We thought we'd drop by and say hello since we were in the area. I see. Thanks so much for coming. I am quite honored to have Miss Mitsuki show me around like this. Yoka, it's your day off, remember? I'm more than happy to show you around. Thank you very much. It looks like Mitsuki's having a lot of fun. It looks like they're sis- It's like they're sisters. It's nice that these two are able to spend some quality time together. Do you have anything new? Ah! The fourth level ones. Those could be useful, but... Kind of expensive. It's twice as expensive despite only being 
1.5 times as strong. That seems wrong somehow. Ugh. Well, at least I got all the almost all the Chaos Mirages I'll ever need. Almost. I think I need one more. The chairman is is currently visiting the shrine. Maybe it wouldn't kill me to take a day off occasionally. I just wanted to let you know I'll be at Sunshine Road in time to meet up. Be sure to take some time to have fun. It is the autumn festival after all. Books or Ryan. During summer break while I was hanging out at the library, I got to know this kid who's my age. Then it turned out that the person was from the class next to mine. We immediately became friends. I always thought reading was something to do alone, but it's nice to share books with someone. Everyone gets something different out of self-help books. After coming to that realization, I've been able to read them without getting completely caught up. Especially when I find out that the author is a hypocrite rock thrower living in a glass house. I actually laugh out loud when they read self-help books like those. My journey on the Five Star was truly an amazing experience. The best views, the best food and service, accentuated with an awesome auditory experience. It was truly a feast for all five senses. It could have happily stayed a passenger forever. Hey Ko, school's out for autumn break, right? You made plans to meet up with Shiori and the rest of your friends tonight, yes? Yeah, we were planning on wandering around the stalls and whatnot. Don't worry though, I'll make sure Shiori gets home at a decent hour. Huh, <laughs> thanks for that, but don't worry about it too much. I'm sure she already wants to enjoy the autumn festival along with everyone else tonight. It'll be a good opportunity for you and your friends to make a lot of good memories together. Heh, <laughs> understood. Recently, Shiori seems a lot more outgoing than usual. Especially when we went to Hokkaido over the summer. It's like she never ran out of energy. I guess she's... Uh, after that incident, she's not taking her mortality for granted. She practically dragged me and my wife around everywhere. It was a lot of fun. Plus, she now she can now explore the world outside of Morimiya. No longer bound to the eclipse. Once we overcame the trial, she already was able to go outside of Morimiya. I can understand why she'd be so happy to be somewhere else. Um, I heard you went location hunting, visiting the places that they filmed in that movie you like, right? Yes, me and Shiori enjoy the novel it was based on, which is about an old railroad worker. If you're interested, I highly recommend watching the movie. She already wants to go back there already. Maybe next time you and your parents could come along. Huh, maybe. If the opportunity comes up, I'd love to. <laughs> Whose friend page is that? Summer Tournament. Whoa, she already also had one. Captain of the ship. Since she's taking over. Shizune. Not quite there yet. Kenichi took the family to Hokkaido. I remember when Shiori stopped by the store a while back. Oh man, she's gotten even harder over the summer. I wonder what happened to her over the summer. Odd experience the flowering of youth. Don't tell your boss. Oh dear god. They're currently holding an autumn reading fair. Come find the perfect book for the fall. This week's Morimiya journal is in as well, so please feel free to take one. Paela. Okay, good. It's only five pages. This weekend, 10.30 and 10.31. August 30th and August 31st. The Morimiya Autumn Festival will be happening across the city. Businesses are preparing for an influx of tourists to the area. Festival by the people for the people. The festival has its roots in the aftermath of the Tokyo earthquake from 10 years ago. It was originally a way for people to celebrate life while at the same time remember those who died. The theme for many events is Halloween, which originally caused some outcry as it was seen as disrespectful to those who didn't survive. But those objections faded as laughter was again heard throughout the city. After the first year, the city put in resources required to make it a sustainable event, which became known as Morimiya's Halloween. It's the event's 10th anniversary, and everyone is pulling out all the stops to make it an event to remember. According to one of the organizers, M. Mitsuki, every business participating in the event is ready to go. Uh, to, uh, go. While getting around town might be a challenge, 
It'll be a lot of fun for the young and old alike. Emma is also the person in charge of organizing the special performance featuring Spika and our very own Morimaru. M could also be Mikuria, maybe. I don't know. Upcoming events, the Tama Monorail Wine Tour is coming back in November. Reserve today. The popular winter wine tasting event is back and with it being the 15th anniversary of the Tama Monorail, it's sure to sell out fast. And with the grand opening of the Amano Group's Monoport, the Monorail is going to be very crowded. Valiant Gear. Amano Labs just announced their newest Valiant Gear past uh, uh, NDF certification. While its specs have yet to be released, rumors say it's the most advanced gear available. Um, military aficionados are already discussing it on NER, even as it was being announced that the new weapon would be on display at the Morimiya NDF base. Sunshine Road, the street north of Morimiya Station famous for Cinema City Theater and its spooky echo effect, will soon be getting a Kotobukiya store. With many events, it's sure to be popular a popular place during the Autumn Festival. And more wisdom even though I'm already maxed out. Well, this does make it easier for those who missed a, a, or, or screwed up missions during the main story. This will give them one last chance to get all the goodies from, uh, from Grandpa. Hmm, I guess I'd better go to Asuza. Welcome all! Come check out our incredible Autumn um, Festival sale! There are huge savings on appliances for fall and winter right now, so please come in today! Huh, I didn't know they already switched to their autumn um, uniforms. Um, excuse me! Oh, have you? I mean, you came because of my posting on Nia, right? Yeah, though Yukino told me about it. You were looking for someone to help you out of your promo campaign, right? Yes, that's right. If you have the time, I can explain the job to you right now. Doing so, we'll start a quest in which you can enlist the aid of a friend. Who would be the best person to take? Of course, color me in. What do you need help with? Thank you very much. First off, please take these. Asuza handed over what she was holding. Balloons and bags of candy and snacks. Ah, oh, so you want me to hand stuff out trick-or-treat style, right? Exactly, although there won't be any tricking on your part. The plan was to pass them out to all the children in the station square during our autumn festival. This year, there were far more people around than in previous years. So we weren't able to give everyone balloons during the initial flood. I see, I think I know what you want me to do now. You want me to track down the kids that didn't get a balloon and give them one, right? That's it. Please, I'm depending on you. It's going to be a lot of work and I'd love to get someone else to help out, but... Okay, if that's the case, is it okay if I call some people I know? What? You know someone who will help? Yeah, at least I think they would. Hold on for a sec, let me make a couple of calls. Sorry about this, I hope we can help. Alright, who should I call? But if I pick them, I won't be able to use them for other activities. I, also, I can also pick Ryota and June. Hmm. I need to pick carefully. Alright, I'm going with Shio for this one. After making a couple of calls, I explained the situation and got a friend to come to the station. We ended up getting one more thing from Azusa. Oh, we have to wear these costumes while handing stuff out. It's starting to feel Halloween-ish. Oh god, if Aki or any of the others see me in this, I'll never live it down. I'm counting on you guys. I just need you guys to walk around Station Square and talk to any children not holding a balloon. Got it. Alright, let's do this. A season of selling. Wait, I, oh, I can't switch to him. He just walks around behind me. Hmm. There's people marked in green. Obviously, we talked to her last. Okay, first let's go to 
Sakura Pharmacy. Oh, there's another kid who didn't get a balloon yet. Please take one. Really? Alright, thanks. Hand over a balloon and a snack. Oh, isn't that nice? Yep, and also means we don't have to spend any money on snacks. In fact, we can use that money to buy something else for dinner tonight. Kenta, you're so reliable. Damn, I know saving money is good and all, but still. Well, he seems happy, so I guess it's fine. I was hoping he'd comment on my costume. Oh, we have to talk to Mitsuki like this. Hi, oh, you're here to help out at Star Camera. You look good in that costume. Heh, <laughs> not funny. Yes, I knew there would be a conversation between them like that, even if it was really small. It looks like you're having a great deal of fun. Please invite me next time, okay? Anyways, this kid. Maybe this will cheer him up after his parents went all strict on him because of his non-perfect test. Hey, why are you guys dressed like wizards from an RPG? And from a fantasy RPG to boot, I like those a lot too. It's cool and all, but super hard me since my parents banned me from playing video games. Well, it's not exactly a costume from a game or anything. I mean, video games are cool and all, but you should unplug today and enjoy the festival. I don't know if this will make you feel any better, but here you go. Hand over balloon and snacks. Thanks, guys. But with all this going on, I might not be able to download that one demo. Thanks for the balloons and candy. Makes me f feel better since I'm not allowed to play video games. I guess I'll just play outside today. Thank you very much. This is really going to help with the family budget. I could probably save even more if I used all the autumn festival sales to my advantage. Whoa, it's a wizard! Hey, Gramp uh, uh, Grandpa Take, why do wizards wear big hats? Hmm, that's... I wonder why. Um, it's because they keep snacks inside their hats, maybe. Anyway, here you go, little girl. We always need some kind of clever explanation. Hand over a balloon and a snack. Yay, thank you. Yeah, make sure you don't trip and fall down. And we also have to explain to her how the balloon floats. Wow, this is go so good. Grandpa, want to share it? Daddy, where are we going to play? Hmm, let's see. Oh, looks like there's other kids here, too. Looks like they just arrived by bus. Please take one. Hand over a balloon and a snack. Ah, oh, balloon. I even got a snack, Daddy. Yeah, good for you. Thanks, guys. Ah, you're welcome. Have fun. It's nice to get peaceful, easy quests like this once in a while. Okay, now books are I in. I think there was that girl uh, over here. Oh, it looks like this girl didn't get one either. Hey, you want a balloon? I also have some snacks. Balloons and snacks? Hmm, and you think this is a good way to trade a lady why exactly? It's not like I'm a child that gets excited over that sort of stuff. Oh, sorry about that. Hmm, girls around this age are kind of complicated, aren't they? But if you really insist, I could take one for you. It's your guys' job, right? I think I can help you out this time. Oh, okay then. Uh, I remember some of the girls back at the orphanage who acted exactly the same way. Hand over a balloon and a snack. It looks like we gave balloons to all the children. Let's hurry back and report to uh, Azusa. Oh, did you finish handing out everything already? Yeah, we managed it somehow. We gave balloons to all the children, I think. Really? Thank you so much. You guys really helped me out. It wasn't that big of a deal. But you must really be motivated to promote the sales uh, to go as far as to pass out balloons and candy. Uh, of course. And while it's good advertising for the store, it's also about giving children a chance to enjoy the Autumn Festival and Halloween at the same time. I see. I guess it's easy enough to understand, and it is fun. It looks like all the kids enjoyed themselves. <laughs> I'm glad I came out to help. 
It made me think about all the kids back at the orphanage. Well, thank you very much for today. Here's a little something to show my appreciation. Please take it. Autumn Festival set. And cookies. Some of the snacks from earlier. And the costumes? Yep, seriously, you really helped me out, so please take it. I hope you two enjoy the Autumn Festival together. Afterwards, we went our separate ways. Virtue increased. Ah, we didn't get any soul points for Chio, though. That sucks. I guess there really is no going back to the past with this one. Sporing a new outfit, she asked Ko for his help with her campaign. Okay. Alright, let's split up. Ko Hinata, you promote the pumpkin carving class. I'll hand out snacks and Ryoto will post up sales flyers. Got it, leave it to me. Wait a second, you want me to put up all those flyers by myself? Of course, Kohina and I have our own responsibilities to attend to. So I bequeath the mindless manual labor to you, oh high and mighty Mr. Sports Club member. Is it just me, or has Shizuru been going in hard on me lately? I'm um, considering your recent actions, you kind of deserve it. The Yama Festival. It's quiet, but still pretty lively. It's really nice. I better go meet up with Ko and the others. I need to help out as, uh, help out as much as I can. Yeah, if I don't finish soon, I won't be able to make it to the meetup. Oh well, if I can keep looking for this sword bag's I can keep looking for this sword bag's owner later. Wait, it's not yours? I picked it up and took it with me, but none of the stuff inside is mine. Ooh, it was in my locker, but Huh, do you want some help looking? I don't worry about it, I'll just look for them at school. It's possible he's the original o Ryota is actually the owner, but he forgot because of the eclipse amnesia effect. Besides, shouldn't you be making sure you finish your job? I won't forgive you if you're late. Ha, huh, that's my line. You you think that the underground would have confiscated it, but now it looks like Ryota's gonna be able to use it again? This idiot, you. Ditching your responsibilities to go play. That's not how it works. Be, just be quick about cleaning it up. I'd like to enjoy the autumn festival. Hey, it's been a while. Huh, aren't you Akihiro? You give up a way different vibe than before, and you definitely changed up your look. You just got out of youth detention and got hooked up with a job. We've been shopping for pots and knives and shit for his place as a kind of celebration. Pots and knives. That's an odd combination. The knives make sense because he's kind of a delinquent, but the pot... Huh. I gotta admit, I feel kind of crappy making him do all of this for me while he's busy. And besides, instant ramen is good enough for a man living alone. You're an idiot, you know that? How long do you think you could survive eating that crap? And if you're going to keep Blaze going, you can't be doing things half-assed like that. Maybe you could start by cooking for some of the- uh, 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 things off by cooking for some of the younger guys in the group. Alright, get it. Damn, I'm never going to be a match for you, am I? Uh, Shio's really good about taking care of those around him. The motorcycle place in town said they'd hire me. It took one hell of a detour, but I think I uh, finally made it to the starting line. I have a hell of a lot of work ahead of me to make up for all the trouble I caused everybody. <laughs> On your mark, after being released from custody, he got a job at a bike shop in Morimiya, with the hopes of starting a new chapter in his life. <laughs> huh, but I think Aki's finally... I'm sure Kazuma's relieved where he ended up. But it means I can't be slacking. Mayo is finally starting to look like a real craftsman. Maybe all that summer training did her some good. She's still too inexperienced for my liking, though. Recently, I've been having Mayu j just hold spirit arms so she can get a feel for them. However, the only way she's going to learn is through practice. Oh, welcome, Tokisaka. Huh, you look worn out. So how's the training been going? I've been finding new and exciting ways to fail every day. But I also learn something new every time, so I'm happy about how things are going. I still have a long way to go, but I'm getting there. That's the spirit. Recently, Asuka has been dropping by to check up on me. Training has been tough, but I'm going to keep doing my best. You hear the news? The galaxy is going to be performing at Akros Tower today. Apparently it was so popular that they had to limit attendance. Talk about amazing. Why don't you go and check it out? What? Nah, it sounds like it's going to be a madhouse, so I think I'll pass. Looks like they're going to hold a pumpkin carving class. I think I'll take the kids over once they get home. The Morimiya lunchbox everyone on Shopping Street came up with was very popular. 
With that in mind, we came up with a new version, the Morimiya Autumn Lunchbox. It's tasty, nutritious, and perfect for taking along to the festival. Ah, there is a fall version, and it's even stronger. But I don't know if it's worth it. Doesn't really. I might be better off just buying stuff from uh, me uh, uh, from Mizuhara. Hey, Ko, enjoying the festival? A lot of folks came in to buy pumpkins today. Our sales are really so soaring. My grandfather hurt his hip falling down during one of the tremors. I think he's on the mend, but after trying some of the tofu I made, he almost jumped up, muttering something about falling behind. Oh man, it's great that he seems to be an energetic self again, but I don't want him to overdo it. That, and I have to try and keep up with him. I'm going to have to work even harder than before. Alright, Momo, let's go learn how to carve a jack-o'-lantern today. Yeah. Um, what's a jack-o'-lantern? Oh, that's right, Momo. You wouldn't know what it is, would you? Don't worry, your big brother is here to show you what's what. It's There's one right behind you. What's a jack-o'-lantern? As long as my big brother is here, I'll be fine. The first autumn festival here in Morimiya was held 10 years ago, just after the Tokyo earthquake. After that, a bunch of youngsters in the sea made an effort to bring everyone smi back everyone's smiles. It's hard to believe the festival got so popular. It's really quite touching. Oh man, it's just an apartment building here. <laughs> Don't you ever get the urge to wander the back streets of cities that you've just arrived in? Man, Shopping Street is always busy every time I come here. I'll kick off the next City Walker special on Festival Edition with a feature on the street. Wow, I don't think I've been back here since we filmed that segment. While we're here, I want to hit up the, that Soba restaurant. Oh, that's where they were. The Soba here is really good. Maybe I'll come here with Sutobu next time without telling my husband. And earlier, Gramps showed me how to make noodles. First it was like bam bam, then it was fud fud fud. It was so cool. Oh, I heard Shio is out and about with his friends today. He's so considerate. Shio volunteered to come into the store today since we're so busy. He's always working so hard. I'm glad he's taking time to relax and enjoy the festival today. I know my husband looks grumpy, but I know he's happy to finally see his grandson. Alright, I think I'll make something sweet for a little Sutomu now. Oh, that's right. There, I remember these two now from that side quest. I think I'll drop by the Sobo place again this afternoon for a drink before hitting the summer festival. Uh, autumn festival. And of course I'm going to have some Soba too. Oh man, it's going to be awesome. Hey dad, I took the dishes that were over there to the sink. Damn it, you're supposed to be a customer and customers don't do things like that. So just sit down, shut up, and enjoy some Sobo with your boy. I wasn't trying to help out or anything, I just did because I was already up and about. Oh man, I know there's a festival today, but I didn't expect it to be like this. I kind of had an idea before, but I didn't know the place was this prosperous. Now I really want to meet the guy that's been helping out around here even more. I can't go behind the counter. This impenetrable curtain. Ah, oh, hot soba with duck. It's really powerful and negates ailment and trap damage. And I'm never going to buy it because it's just too expensive. Uh, I wish I would... I wish the economy in this game wasn't so strict. Welcome, sorry about things being so chaotic. It's crowded right now, but sit wherever you like. Oh, Tokisaka, good job. Toa, I mean, hello. I take it you're finished with everything at school? Yes and no. Everybody left early today as all the teachers have to help with patrol the festival. But before that, we decided to have a little girls gathering. Why don't you join us, Ko? Girls gathering, huh? Thanks, well pass. I wouldn't want to ran your parade. Boo, don't be a chicken, Tokisaka. And you shouldn't tr t uh, try to turn down invites from beautiful older women when romance is in the air. Oh god, leave me alone. You're not supposed to hit on students. Funny th that you, of all people, would say that, Saki. I don't think I've ever seen you flirt before. Yep, I don't think you ever said anything like that even when we were in school together. Damn it, you two. What are you thinking saying stuff like that in front of a student? Go away! It looks like they're having fun. They have known each other since way back when, after all. 
They meddle too much. <laughs> I have people like me too. Who like me too. Yes, yes, we know. Hey, she's so cute. Maybe she got a crush on Kobe because he gave her all those stuffed animals? It's sometimes absolutely necessary to stop and smell the roses like this. Although it's a darn shame we can't have any sake right now since we're on patrol duty. Have fun tonight, Ko. Just try not to go too overboard, okay? None of us ha has really changed since we were all in school together, huh? Although you really haven't changed, Toa. What in the heck is that supposed to mean, Honami? Oh, Ko, I'm glad you came. Did you hear about my request from Yukino? Yeah, that's why I'm here, actually. Looking forward to working with you, Mr. Yanagi. Ha, <laughs> thanks for helping me out again. Actually, there is something I really need your help with now. Do you have time to go through the details? Yes, sure, I can start right now. So what do you want me to do? Oh, you're a big help. I asked for a few others in the area to pitch in materials and tools for my pumpkin carving class. Unfortunately, something came up right, right now and I can't go around and grab everything. And if I don't do it now, the class will start super late. I see, so you want me to go around and collect everything for you. That sounds easy enough, but what's the emergency you have to take care of? Um, uh, well, you know, it's something super important that could change my life forever. Is it that girl from the flower shop? It totally is. Yes, this is Yanagi. Hey, are you ever going to come pick this stuff up? If you don't come for it soon, I'm going to saw it off. Whoa, please, just wait a little longer. I'll be right there. Uh, what was I thinking? Scheduling things on the same day as the album festival. I'm not sure what this has to do with anything, but it looks like you're in a hurry to go. So leave the store to me and get going. Thank you, Ko. You don't know how big of a help you are. Here, take this. I know we're a list of things to pick up. There's a lot of stuff you'll need to carry, so it'll be a bit of a hassle to do it by yourself. I'll come back here as soon as I can. I'm counting on you. With that, Yanagi bolted from the store, almost tripping over his own feet in his haste. He looked really stressed over something. I should ask him about it later. But looking at this list, he's right about it being a hassle for one person. I should call someone to come over because I'm going to need the help. Okay, time to get at it. I cannot pick Shio ever again. Ryota. Afterwards, I explained the situation to the person I convinced to help out at Yanagi Sports. Sorry about dragging you out like this, but I really need the help. Hey, Yanagi sounds like he's up against it. I'd be less of a man if I didn't help out. So what do we need? To, where, do, where do we need to go? Dude, weren't you supposed to be part of the Shopping Street Festival planning group? I just forgot for a sec, okay? Give me a break. I'm according to Yanagi's list here. We need to go to the grocery store, candy store, and this blacksmith. Alright, let's get started. The Great Pumpkin. Hey Ko, Ryota, looks like you guys are also pr are pretty busy also. Tokisaka, once you've finished helping them, I need you to return here as soon as possible. Got it, I sh it shouldn't take me too long so I'll be back in a flash. Knock it off, I don't want to be your dog. Well, that's right, Mr. Yanagi rushed out of here earlier. Oh well, that doesn't change the fact that we still have things to do. Looks like you've gone through a lot, but let's both do our best. Something you say something about Ryota being in the party. Yo, Mayu! Oh, Tokisaka and everyone, welcome. Um, so is there a reason you all came by? Yeah, it, was, it has to do with the upcoming pumpkin carving class. I explained how I was told to come by and pick up a few things for the carving class. I see, it sounds like Mr. Yanagi is really busy. Grandfather, do you have that thing, Mr. Yanagi? Yes, I know. Here you go. Carving kit. It's a spoon and knife to carve out the pumpkins. They seem really sturdy and easy to use. It's a custom item designed by my grandfather. He wanted to make sure they'd be safe for children to use, so he made a bunch of prototypes. Hey, no need to blabber up on about stuff like that. I know this sounds weird, but it's kind of strange seeing him do normal smithing work. Uh, why? Hasn't this place been a blacksmith since the beginning of time? Um, it has more to do with us than him. Hey, no need to blabber on about stuff like that. Just take it already. Or we're gonna have to erase Ryota's memories again. Mio and I have to finish off the extras. Alright, we'll be taking off then. Good luck with your training. Thanks. You can tell Yanagi that I will gu gu guarantee the quality will be top notch. It's not an easy job. Hmm. I'm sure my grandfather designed the carving set so it will be safe to, to use it by kids. 
I hope the pumpkin carving class goes okay. Ryota's father? Hey there, Ko, welcome. Ryota, I thought you were helping out with things. Well, it's not my fault if you can't go hang out if, if, if with your friends because you slacked off. I know. Yanagi asked me to run an errand for him. I explained about how I came to pick up the things for the pumpkin carving class. Oh, I see. Actually, I remember him mentioning something about that this morning. Hold on a second, I'll bring it out right now. Probably the pumpkins themselves. It's huge! People actually use these monstrosities for jackal lanterns Yeah, I ordered it especially for this day. I was prepared to go into the red if needed be. Probably had to pick... Uh, 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 you probably had to pick some perfectly shaped ones, too. You had to bend them, to, so, so to speak. Here, take it already, you thief. It's going to be hell carrying this. Giant pumpkin. Should be plural. Hey, Grandma Shio. Oh, you're a Sosuke's boy, right? Welcome. You two have always gotten along so well, even when you were both little. Well, it's not like we can ever get away from each other. Mm-hmm. Feel free to relax and browse. There's lots, lots of snacks and toys. Actually, we're here about something else today. I explained that we were here to pick up things for the pumpkin carving class. Ma oh my, so that's why you're here. So Yanagi finally made his decision. I know his mother would be overjoyed. Okay, what is she talking about? Alright, I'll go get it. Please wait a moment. The LED lamp to put inside the pumpkin. I guess it's safer than trying to light a fire inside it. I see, it's a lamp to put inside the pumpkin. Thank you, Grandma Shio. Hey, no problem. Yanagi and everyone worked really hard to prepare for that event. You all should try to have as much fun as you can at the event, too. Yeah, got it. Looks like this is the last of everything. Let's head back to Yanagi's. Wait, I can talk to Toa. Maybe she'll have a comment about this. Ko, where are you up to now? It's a part of part, it's part of a part-time gig I picked up. We just have to walk around Shopping Street for a bit. Aha, I see. But Ko, aren't you supposed to be meeting up with everyone from the XRC soon? And seeing as... It's the um festival, you probably don't want to be late, right? Yeah, yeah, I know. Looks like we have all the stuff that was asked for. Should we go back and wait for Yanagi to return? I don't think there's any secret conditions for this one. Let's go back. Plus, well, I'm already maxed out anyways. After returning to Yanagi Sports with all the stuff, we decided to hang out and wait for Yanagi. I'm back! Welcome back, Mr. Yanagi. Sorry, Kobe, I didn't realize I was running so late. I'm guessing er getting everything together was as difficult as I thought it'd be. No worries, I called him the cavalry. Yo, Mr. Yanagi. I see. Seriously, thank you, everyone. It's because of your help I was able to make it in time. Oh yeah, I was going to ask you about that. What was the emergency? Um, actually, it's kind of embarrassing to just show it off like this. With that, Yanagi pulled out a small box and perched it on his outstretched hand. In inside it was a ring with a small jewel on it. Is that an engagement ring? Is that for the chick at the floor shop you've been going out with recently? Ah, uh, yeah. I bought it from the jewelry store in Nanahoshi Mall. I see. Well, I never expected it to be something like this. Well, I have no idea if she'll accept it or not. And to be honest, I'm not sure I have the courage to ask her. Oh my god, it's almost time! I can't wait to see what we're supposed to do first. Shoot, this isn't the time to be lolly lollygagging. I need to prepare for the pumpkin carving class. There are already folks waiting outside. Really? Alright, well how about two? With that, the store was quickly reconfigured and the first pumpkin carving class started as scheduled. Halloween. And what happens to all the filling and all the uh, 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 filling inside of the c uh, pumpkin? Hmm. Everyone sat down together and carved a number of jackal lanterns of those who wandered in to take the class. Thanks to you guys, the pumpkin carving class was a huge success. 
Really, none of this would have happened without your help. I want you to have these as tokens of my appreciation. It's a costume. Is this seriously? I can actually wear this? Yeah, I thought I'd make a, uh, I'd make a few of those to give out to those who participated. Take it. It's yours. Won't it get smelly? Fair enough. Th thanks. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to say in this case, but good luck with the ring and all. Hell yeah, Yunagi, you got this. Eh, uh, yeah, I'll do my best. Afterward, everyone went their separate ways. More virtue. Yunagi, we're out. Pop the big one. Huh. I want to see what happens if I try to wear the jack o' lantern. Uh, yeah. I'm not sure this is gonna smell good. Unless it's a, unless it's a plastic jack o' lantern. Even then. Let's stick with the witch hat. What the? It's that fox kid from the side stories! Dang it! Trying to intimidate me. Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of Tokyo Xanadu EX Plus. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.